Hi there, it's Jen Coulter from the South Rockies Field Team and we're here today in the Harvey Pass area in the Flathead region and we're just coming to do some more snowpack and weather obs in the area and as we were ski touring up we came across this uh, avalanche here. You might remember the other day in our blog, we were talking about how we were getting woomphing and settling in the snowpack, but we weren't yet getting avalanches. There just wasn't enough of a slab built over the weak layer of facets yet to propagate and cause avalanches. But you can see in this area, whether it's because a little bit more snow load, uh, some settlement and some wind effect, you can see that we definitely have uh, the slab properties of a firm layer over a weak layer um, that was able to have this avalanche initiate and propagate. Avalanches like this are often remote triggered uh, from thin spots. We can see uh, maybe from the rock or up the ridge ways here, we can see a snowmobile track. I'm standing on one end of it and you can see it on the other end of the debris here and uh, the debris came down and actually covered the sled track. So this is also just a good reminder to space yourselves out as you're traveling through avalanche terrain and only expose uh, one sledder to the slope at a time when you're climbing. <laughs> 